What better way to start off Factory Friday this week? We got Hucker in the house. What's up? What's up, guys? I, uh, I bit the bullet. It's finally time. I've been putting it off forever, but I'm building up a brand new Fit 29 for beach cruising. And uh, I've been doing a lot of fishing lately, so I'm going to start riding this bad boy to the fishing hole. Uh, super excited to finally have one of these things. Wanted one for a long time and decided, you know what? It's time. They're super rad. I'm going to be doing a little time lapse here to show how simple these bikes are to put together in a timely manner. They come pre assembled, they're awesome. I got this yellow one because yellow is badass. All right, so that thing's. Pretty much 80% assembled already in that box. And it even comes with pads. Ooh, lordy. Oh. All right, well, all the welders have already went home, but uh, we got Hucker in the house. Let's go check out your front triangle. Yeah, so over here, we're doing another batch of my frame. We're gonna have different decals this run. Uh, these ones are already welded up. These ones are just tacked. There's not the gusset yet. And then the finished product for the front triangle is that. S&M shield on the bottom, Shaka on the top. Shaka. Brand new, ready to get the back end slapped on and off to paint. All right. Soon in the shops. Yeah. So that's a wrap right there. You just put that together. How long did it take you to put that together? It took maybe 12 minutes with wow. pumping up the tires. Uh, like I said, they come about 80% assembled. So super dialed, you just unwrap it, slap it together and you're rolling. Super clean looking bike, right? Yeah. And also, video. So what do you got there? Yeah, so to win the Hucker ODI grip giveaways, it's super simple. I'm gonna post it. All you gotta do is leave a comment, uh, tag three friends, and make sure you follow ODI grips, SM bikes, and Fit Bike Co. We got Hoder in the building. I'm here, man. I'm in the SM bikes building right now. Just uh, over here coming up to uh, check out all my new frames and that all just came in and you know we're just i guess they were made here but you know they just came in from paint and uh yeah we you know we got a whole new run of them in and uh tw you know we got the we got the for the smaller size frame we got the uh trans teal and the trans orange they both look super cool like super unique colors and just cool looking classic just I love the clear. I love the clear colors. They just you could see the welds through them, and just, those bikes. The bikes look good like that, and uh, they look a little more custom, a little more like aftermarket, a little more American made. You know what I'm saying? They but, are. Uh, <laughs> yeah, everything in you know everything in this in this company is American made, so it's super cool. And uh, but yeah, came here to check out these bikes, the the trans orange and trans teal, in the smaller frames, and then we also got the XL frames. And we have uh, we have the uh, the clear, the trans black, and the trans black to trans red fade. Super cool, super good bike. I, I really like the you know I, I like the fade color. It's it's like a dark, so you can't really tell as much. And you know it's not, it's not super standoutish, but it it looks clean. You know, especially I like the trans the trans black. It looks super. You know, with with like the with the with the welds coming through and everything. Mm -hmm. It just you, you know, see the bluing underneath there a little bit. Yeah, yeah. It looks like you've already signed a couple of these. Yeah, I signed a couple of these for the uh, the old live, but uh, it didn't work out too well. We tried. We're gonna, we we're tried, gonna get better we at tried. that. The, the, the bars are the bars are you know slimming down up here. You know, we, <laughs> we're it's it's a little too pixelated. But I'll sign another couple for for the for the factory Friday. You know what I'm saying? We got the trans teal right here. Boom. Yeah. And then we have the XLs up here, but I don't want to pull down the whole shelf. Because if I try to climb up there and you're almost tall enough yeah, to just I'm do it. Yeah, I'm almost there. Try <laughs> <laughs> to pull it off. Right? All right. Ah. Anybody watching this, this is about seven and a half feet off. Oh, that there one's up there. <laughs> Threw my back out. Oh, oh man. Shit. I can't hit the man's part tonight. Oh, we also dude. got Bones in Factory Friday yeah. again. Got my dog What's Bones. Up, dude? He already has been like an hour at the building and he already looks like a shop dog. He's just he's so, chill. so dark, dude. It's crazy looking. But we're gonna it's go all good. check out your grips and pedals too. Yeah, dude. So now we're in the 
Now we're in the grip section, yep. also the shipping section, you know, where all the boxes go out. And uh, we're, you know, I'm looking at my grips here and I got 14 colors. That's, that's absolutely insane. Thank you for the support. Thank you for buying these grips and making it so we can do 14 colors and every single kid on the planet's bike, you know, can match their grips, you know, they can match their pedals up, everything, you know, you can mix match, however you want to do it. How, whatever, whatever makes you happy, you know, so. But you know we have the, we you know so I'll start out with you know the, the colors of the grips and we got the black, we got the black grips right here. Don't screw the packaging up. We got the navy blues. We have, damn, we got the clears. I like these. I like these too because it's super cool. You can put a, uh, you can put like a sticker on your on your handlebars underneath your grips, and it'll it'll be showing through. So like. That's another thing, another cool thing you can do with the, with the clear grips. God damn. I think these are all, yeah, we got the blues, the yeah, white we keep blues. Those, we keep those in bags so nothing gets dirty, yeah, so they don't get dirty. Bag, you, don't, you, don't, you don't want everything getting dirty. Yeah, you want those the clean when you get them. So you get the, you got the baby blues. I guess they call it cayenne, the cayenne blue. We got the, uh, we got the uh, glow in the darks, you know, for the night riders. The ones that want to film night clips, you know, on the streets. I get it, I get it. I can't really see in the dark, so I don't really film too much at night. But uh, we have the Army Greens Classic. That was one of the first original colors. I think the original colors we did was the, the green, the graphite gray, which is another color. And we did the blacks. So those three were, I think, the first first colors we did. And now we got, dude, it's crazy. The graphite gray. We got the tan. That's the gum right there. The gum, tan, whatever. Call it you know, what you want. Whatever you want to call it. <laughs> we got the action green. Action green, you know, for my Seahawks out there. Seahawks fans. Yep, pink, yep. We got pink grips and we also have pink pedals. So, you know, you can match them up along with, you know, we have army green pedals to match these up. And then oh, I'm going to drop these in because there's so many colors in here. We got the purples. Purples are a dope color smoking on that purple no <laughs> and when we have red always a good color and then i my new color that i'm riding is the white ones and they go so good over there with that you can see them on that bike but they go so good on the on the chrome handlebars i love this those in the gr lime green ones are the ones we just got in yeah the lime green the, the action newest editions. green and the uh and the all whites super you know super good you know just having all these colors, you just like I said earlier, you can just mix match everything you want, you know? Match them up with the pedals and match them up with your bike, whatever you want to do. Yeah, dude, we just got, you know, tons of colors. We got one more. Uh, oh, we got another we got color. One more. We got yellow. Oh, we got to get that action yellow, too. Action yellow, no. <laughs> Rasta yellow, you know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, SM yellow. That's the actual, that's what we were looking yeah. for. You know, SM yellow, SM red. Fuck it. Run a third grip, dude. Fuck it, you know. Run it all. <laughs> all right, man. Well, thank cool. you. Yeah, and uh, yeah, thank you always for supporting, uh, support me, and support my riding, and you know, buying all the products, and yeah, thank you for supporting S and M bikes. All right. <laughs> all right. Now we're in the pedal yeah, section. Now we're now we're in the pedal section over here at the building, and uh, you know, we did we have all the pedals in stock right now. Any all the colors, you know, we have the. The, the Hoder BT or S and M BTM pedals, whatever you want to call them, but uh, yeah, we have these in stock. The uh, the Army Greens, I see yellow. We got the blacks down here, and then what do we got? Graphite gray, mm -hmm. and then we got the baby blues, sky blue, whatever you want to call it, and uh, we got reds down here. Man, it's crazy. You know, we we all the colors damn near match all the grips now. They do. 14, 14 colors and grips. And I don't know what, it was that six, seven pairs of pedals, you know, seven different colors and pedals. It's super cool. You can mix match, you know, I, that's what I like to do a lot of the time. But right now I got to, I'm keeping it classy with the white grips. The new white, the new white color on the chrome bars looks super clean. Um, yeah. All right. All right. So I was talking about earlier, I'm running the uh, BTM XL frame. 21 and a half it's the uh trans black to trans red fade super clean looking i you know i like the i like the taller standover because i'm a little taller it doesn't make the bike look so small on me even though it still looks 
incredibly small on me, but yeah, that's what I'm running. And uh, you know, I got the uh, S&M laid back seat post on there with the old classic seat clamp S&M wrapped. Love it with the, uh, and then I'm running the uh, pitchfork wide mouth forks. Yep. And I got a S&M enduro stem enduro race them with uh i don't know if it's a race them but an enduro stem mm -hmm. with it's 55 millimeter and i did the instead of like the, the solid cap i did the two individual caps and i used to have the two green or the two you know the btm wrap ones yeah. but the other one you know it, it was 10 years they last 10 years with it you know just like riding all this big shit and had to had to take one off it didn't work wasn't working out as well so through you know got that on there and then i got the chrome super high bars let's go check out the front yeah of i got the super high chrome bars with the uh with the white grips like i was just saying too I mean, it just it just looks clean it's looking classy. good yeah it looks super good i'm soaked on it bones likes it everyone likes it bones approved yeah bones approved all right man thank you hey jason uh what frames did we just get in from paint Timbo doyle Hallahan Blue Group Doyle or MODs. All right. Got some Hallahan MODs in there and some uh, Doyle Yellow right there, MOD frame. Fresh back from paint. So we're also sending off race forks and pitchfork XLTs. These have all been uh, been through the zinc process already. Now they're going out to get painted. One rack comes off, another rack goes on. Get out of here before signing them oh, grips. Man, Got a handful of grips right here. Gonna he's gonna sign them up for us, and uh, we're gonna probably throw them in some orders. Maybe keep some around for people that might want to um, email us or when you place your order, request one. Hopefully we have some left still. Ooh. All right, he's gonna sign all these. You got some black in there. Got some got clear, some yellows, clear some yellows black. in there. All right, man. All right, we have 13 pairs of grips now signed by Mike Hoder. We're gonna do a special here. The first 13 people that go on snmbikes.com and place an order, all you have to do is mention Mike Hoder signed BTM grips, and we're gonna toss a pair in for you. These will not last long. Place your orders. Hey, Steven, what do you got right there? Woo, we got new Fit Banners in stock. These are 24 by 38, super heavy duty vinyl. They have grommets in each four of the four corners. These will look great in your shop, in your garage, in your living room. Anywhere you want to put them, fit banners. Now in stock. So let's go check out this tumbler we have here in the shop. Now, in this tumbler, we do all the dropouts for the forks and the frames. Right now we have spacers in there for the 19 millimeter American bottom bracket kit. Stand by, we'll get a picture of those when they come out. All right, we're done. So now you can see how clean these spacers are. Everything is looking great. Pretty soon you'll see uh, us put the 19 millimeter American bottom bracket kits back into stock. Next thing they got to go to anodize and then they come back from anodize and then we press the bearings in, send them off to Rita. Rita packages everything and then we ship them out to you guys.
All right, fresh and back in stock. We now have 52 millimeter enduro stems in matte black. We're just putting them together now. All right. All right, check this out. We have an exclusive order build for Pork Chop BMX. They're picking up a bunch of retro shafted redneck stems. They're picking up polished gold, red, black, and blue. It's a special order. Contact us if you want to do a special order similar. There's those retro shafted redneck stems getting loaded up right now. Steven's putting another box on the truck. Now you guys can always contact us if you have a legit special order request. We're all ears. All right, we got something real exciting here today. Fresh back from paint, hot off the presses, we have the Chris Doyle MOD frame or MO Doyle frame in dirt bike yellow. These are all gonna get stickered up. We're gonna get some photos of them here today. These are gonna go into stock ASAP. Chris Doyle frame, dirt bike yellow. Whoop. Look at how nice those Doyle frames look right here. Now we also got back from paint this week. Boom, small batch of Pitchwork XLTs. In the same yellow as the Doyle frame, the dirt bike yellow. These are also gonna go into stock.